What's up guys? It's cold. It's a little snowy, but not really. And I'm the Cholo. How's everybody doing today? Tonight? It's dark as fuck right now. It's like 1030 almost. Um, anyways, we're going to jump into another Chris Chan video. We're going to dissect his uh, his newest video that, that Chris posted. So I've gone ahead and I've taken the liberty of dismantling that video a little bit. I took out a lot of the dead time, a lot of the uhs and mmms, and, and a lot of him just doing this. Cause it, cause that, cause that's fucking weird, and it it scares me a little. He's, I mean, he does he scare me? No, but his behavior, uh, that's fucking terrifying. Anyways, one of these days I'll do a update video where I uh, give a prediction on what I think he's gonna do to Barb, cause I still think that's gonna end with the murder, maybe murder suicide, who knows? Anyways, let's go ahead and jump into this. Um, yeah. Let's check it out. Here we go. Greetings, everyone. This is Christ Chan Sanji Prime here once again. Focused and connected. Everything. And I will start off with mentioning, of course, the Andamite Rally <coughs> Convention. Flutter and I, we did attend the Friday. Flutter. And we were going to attend the Saturday. We were intercepted. And as you all note, as I have been simplified during the event, I can't tell you to love and keep my calm. What the fuck was that? Lean back and his eyes got real wide and it almost looked like his pupils just like instant went like that was crazy looking uh, it cannot possibly be that I'm that stoned but I don't know kind of scary looking to me I did try to explain explain and yet <clears throat> at the moment the demons were too great in that event organizer and I feel sorry for that individual and their accomplices that were with them at the time. Shit, me too, man. And me too. despite the efforts of the minority, we did still have a very good weekend. And I was the one wearing the striped socks. Where you so guys? you mentioned that, and think about that as you will. Outside of all that, <coughs> I can't be the only one who uh, got caught off guard by that eye roll. That shit was it's getting spooky. <laughs> Fucking spooky. All those that dare do repeat history in the dark ways by following that of the demons and devils and even Satan himself in the temptations of darkness and try to thwart me. They all shall be thwarted shortly enough. It is the divine will, along with that of Russia being a modern day Babylon, to fall as Babylon did, and Vladimir Putin died by his own sword. And everything coming to fruition, to where I have risen before, and I have many times in this lifetime as well. What the fuck is he talking about? I don't know if he's like spurging out right now. Um, <clears throat> talking about Vladimir Putin and Russia falling like Babylon? Is that what he said? I already forgot. <laughs> um, just, man, just wild. Wild. Oh, man. Chris, this guy, this person, just wow, just wow. In the later book, which is, is escaping my kind. 
apologies if it's not completely fluid because a lot of stuff that I cut out, like I, I cut out like fat chunks out of his video. So like it's not completely fluid in, in what he's talking about topic to topic to topic. I mean, it wasn't to begin with, but after I cut it up, it's it's like watching a clip show of just randomly assorted 30 second clips. That's all. Anyways, let's continue. I'm just assuming, y'all know what I mean. <clears throat> but then I am the one avatar of all existence. Okay. So definitely be careful what you wish for. <laughs> Whether or not I had common. What the fuck does that mean? <coughs> you are the one Avatar of true existence? Like. Like Avatar the movie? Because <laughs> that's, that's. I think of James James Cameron blockbuster hit Avatar the movie. And I think, like, they made a second one too. I think. Um, I don't know if that's what he's talking about, but. I don't know. I don't know, with this, with, with this person. Tit on that, which does not exist this timeline, my little pony, Generation 5. Make your mark, tell your tale, a new Generation movie. There is still time to shelve all that past bro and get rid of it. Okay, just there on screen it said, here, listen carefully. I forgot about this, I forgot. I, the reason I put that on screen was so it would remind me when, um, I play this by, it reminded me of something I wanted to talk about. <clears throat> I don't know if I'm just stupid or I'm hearing something that's not what I think it is, which very well could be the case. But I swear, right after Chris bumps that camera and has that little stumble, you can hear what sounds like someone have a, like a, a little bit of a giggle in the background. And it reminded me there's a little bit later in the video I don't know if I marked it out or not. <clears throat> Excuse me. I don't know if I marked it out or not in the rest of this. <sighs> Fuck. But it, th there's there's two or three times where it sounds like I can hear somebody like giggling or um, going. I don't know if the audio picked me up doing that. <clears throat> Excuse me. Um, yeah, uh, apologies for all that, uh, I don't know if, um, god, I'm just saying the same shit over and over again, anyways, anyways, I'm just spinning my wheels, okay, let's continue, it, yeah, it just sounds like, I think I can hear someone in the background giggling, I'll rewind it a few seconds, and we'll go from there. Let's go from here. Movie. There is still time to shelve all that past bro and get rid of it. Because as long as they remain, further developments, which are bad, I don't know. this timeline, they shall continue. Might have just been really Money bad. really corrupted the business people. It has corrupted the arts. And that has been exemplified. Money corrupted the business people. I thought the whole point of being a business people was to make money. Like, Jesus Christ. Find in the G5 media, which was re released, re released prematurely. As I have foreknown and foretold, as everyone else have been bared, understood, and observation of. that we are good in this timeline in this our prime universe <coughs> as the dimension merge does complete and the ultimate miracle manifests <coughs> excuse me it is right <coughs> it is good and I also note there is no reason to block me on social media because even if you do you're still going to be attacked by those that follow you those that follow me, those that follow and troll all 
those that are famous and creative. As they should. Anyone that follows you or that is friends with you should be fucking harassed and bullied. Uh, <clears throat> yeah, that's, <laughs> that's all there is to that. Because they tried to just... And a side note, man, his his son and Chuma Dying is looking rough. Discourage us about the minority that exists within. And what we need to do is just let that slide. We need not heed their words. <laughs> we need not let that affect us deeply. Yeah. All of you hear my call and understand. For we all coexist together in this drama, in this form of hell, as it were. It is up to us to beat all the haters and fakers and darkest sick individuals that try to tempt us, that try to sort us into other varying emotional directions. <laughs> that is not right. By just simply ignoring them. <laughs> Meditate on that as you will and shall, for it is right and good. And follow that which is like power, good and righteous. But when you do that, and live of your own volition, and using common sense, <laughs> and following the guidance that feels right and good and light powered, that is very good indeed. And blocking the one individual, which is I, is not right. Which is I. Because that is not gonna to me. prevent any of those, be it from my fandom or your fandom, all of you. Sure. You know that it is they that make those comments. You want to report and block mm -hmm. them. In my name, Jesus Christ, D. Weston Chandler, Sanchi Prime. There he goes with the eyes again. Or I am, as I am also known as, Chris Chan. Christ Chan. Chris Chan. Jesus Christ Chan, Sanchi Prime. Buddy, no. You're I am not Chris to be cursed. That's it. My name is not to be used in slander or death of me of any sort. Fuck you, Chris Chan. Bitch. Do this, and you will feel a massive week in your day, as it were. Please do. Please do. 2007 called. Did it. That's not me anymore. Period. I just want to point it real quick. That hair, my God, is that just not the most West Virginia thing you've ever seen? Just, wow. So get over yourselves. That said me, for I am good. I am grounded. I am much better now. And I shall not be tempted or swayed by any other dark means whatsoever. And everyone is tested. Fail the test by approaching me with any forming of life where you pretend that you don't recognize me, where you see me as someone else. And you post that on the internet and such places on the internet. You shall be swift divine retribution in one way or another. Doubt. To not but... What are you fucking talking about? You fucking lunatic. <clears throat> you like, do you know how... You have doxxed yourself so, so many times over the years. The more I dug into Chris Chan, the more I realized not just is he a locale of exceptional standards, but he's an idiot. I mean, not an idiot savant like some autistic people. I know some autistic people... You know what, I'm not even going to say what stupid stereotypes I've heard because they're probably all fucking wrong. But I know plenty of autistic people that are, are fully functioning. They have zero special needs. And I've seen some that have a lot of special needs. And that's fine. 
I know there's a spectrum to it. That's all I really know. I don't want to sound, I don't want to stick my foot in my mouth and sound like an asshole because I don't know what I'm talking about. I don't. But I forgot where I was going with that point. Chris's autism, it makes him weird. He does a lot of weird stuff. Does a lot of dumb things. That's what it was. He, he does a lot of dumb things. He doxed himself. That's what it was. Doxed himself. And then he's saying he doesn't want pictures of himself on the internet. Okay, you, you just saw me in real time. Remind myself of a point that I forgot. And you saw me also trail off. And now I forgot where the trail off was. So I'm back to my original point. But anyways, anyway. <clears throat> doesn't want to be posted on the internet. Pictures of him or his likeness or whatever. Yet he has doxed himself. Countless, countless, countless times. Just, just kind of ridiculous. I mean, Cyrax does a lot of ridiculous shit too. I guess nobody's really surprised by this anymore. More, more so just entertained than anything. Let's finish it up. Anything online, whether it be a selfie with me in the picture or any picture with I and my friends and family and so forth, without my personal consent. Aside from that... Yeah, that's totally gonna work on the internet. Fucking idiot. Continue on as you will and shout and that which is good like power and righteous. And it is rightly so. And it is rightly so. Fuck. I bless all of you who watch this video and understand. Don't bless me, motherfucker. Don't need it, don't want it. Anyways, there we have it. Uh, Greetings, everyone. That was Chris Chan's new video, picked apart and void of all the excessive bullshit. I mean, still had a lot of dumb bullshit in it. Hopefully I left just enough to make it somewhat entertaining. <clears throat> if not, tell me about it. Tell me what I can do to make it better. I do appreciate it. I'm a small channel and I'm learning how to do all this by myself. I like just got a laptop. I just put the money into it like a couple weeks ago for Christmas. So um, any tips, any constructive criticism is more than welcome. Uh, if you're still here at the end of the video, I do appreciate it more than you know. I really, really do. Uh, yeah, it, it means a lot to me. It, it, like I said, as a small channel, it means a lot. Thank you. Um, hit that like, subscribe button if you haven't already. And if it's your first time here, thank you for checking me out. I appreciate it, again, more than you know. Even if you just stopped by one time, I appreciate it so, so much. It's it's phenomenal. I appreciate it so much. I can't say that enough. <clears throat> um, okay, we'll call that a wrap. And shortly after this video comes out, within a day, if even that long, there will be a new Cyrax video coming up. It's ready to go. I just got to make a few quick final tunes to it or final touch-ups to it, and it'll be fired off into the ether. Anyways, thank you guys. I've been the Cholo. You've been the audience. And Chris Chan has been the locale for today. Thank you again for stopping by. We'll see you next time.